Good afternoon. Welcome to the Daily Office. And thank you for joining me. Happy Thanksgiving. This is evening prayer for Thursday, November the 22nd. And the scripture for this service, Psalm 145. And Joel chapter 2, verse 21 to 27. O oh God, come to my assistance. Make haste to help me. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. I extol you, my God, my ruler, and I bless your name forever and ever. Alleluia. Psalm 145. I extol you, my God, my ruler, and I bless your name forever and ever. Every day I bless you. And I praise your name forever and ever. <clears throat> great you are, my God, and greatly to be praised. Your glory is awesome. One generation shall tell your works to the next and declare your mighty acts. I speak of the glorious honor of your majesty and of your wondrous works. And the peoples shall speak of your terrible acts, and I will declare your greatness. They shall publish the memory of your great goodness and shall sing of your righteousness. You are gracious and full of compassion, slow to anger and of great loving kindness. You are good to all and your tender mercies are over all your works. All your works shall praise you and your saints shall bless you. They shall speak of the glory of your reign and talk of your power to make known to the people your mighty acts and the glory of your strength. Your dominion is an everlasting dominion, and your strength endures from generation to generation. You uphold all that fall and raise all that are bowed down. The eyes of the people wait upon you, and you give them their food in due season. You open your hand and sate the desire of every living thing. You are righteous in all your ways and holy in all your works. You are close to all that call upon you, to all that call upon you in truth. You will fulfill the desires of those who fear you and also hear their cry and save them. You preserve all who love you, but all the wicked will you destroy. My mouth shall speak your praise and let all flesh bless your holy name forever and ever. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. I extol you, my God, my ruler, and I bless your name forever and ever. Amen. The lesson is from the prophet Joel, chapter 2, beginning at verse 21. Do not fear, O soil, be glad and rejoice, for Yahweh has done great things. Do not fear, you animals of the field, for the pastures of the wilderness are green, the tree bears its fruit, the fig tree and the vine give their full yield. O children of Zion, be glad and rejoice in Yahweh your God, for God has given the early rain for your vindication. God has poured down for you abundant rain, the early and later rain as before. The threshing floors shall be full of grain and the vats shall overflow with wine and oil. I will repay you for the years that the swarming locust has eaten, the hopper, the destroyer, and the cutter, my great army which I sent against you. You shall eat in plenty and be satisfied and praise the name of Yahweh your God, who has dealt wondrously with you. And my people will never again be put to shame. You shall know that I am in the midst of Israel, and that I, Yahweh, am your God, there is no other. And my people shall never again be put to shame. Here ends the lesson. Now let us give thanks to God our Father for all his gifts so freely bestowed. <clears throat> for the beauty and the wonder of your creation in earth and sky and sea. 
for all that is gracious in the lives of men and women, revealing the image of Christ. For our daily food and drink, our homes and families and our friends. For our minds to think and hearts to love and hands to serve. For health and strength to work and leisure to rest and play. For the brave and the courageous who are patient in suffering and faithful in adversity. For all valiant seekers after truth, liberty, and justice. For the communion of saints in all times and places. And above all, we give you thanks for the great mercies and promises given to us in Christ Jesus our Lord. To him be praise and glory with you and the Holy Spirit, now and forever. Amen. Our beloved which art in heaven, holy is your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, Forgive us as we forgive others. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. We give you thanks, most gracious God, for the beauty of the earth and the sky and the sea, for the richness of mountains, plains, and rivers for the songs of birds and the loveliness of flowers. We praise you for these good gifts and pray that we may safeguard them for our posterity. Grant that we may continue to grow in our grateful enjoyment of your abundant creation to the honor and glory of your name, amen. Bless Jesus, my soul, and may the God of hope fill us with all joy and peace in believing through the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Alleluia. Happy Thanksgiving.